How you doing, woodworker? Today we're going to talk about the essential tools that a beginner woodworker needs to start making awesome projects. Let's go. You don't need those expensive table saws and miter saws, jointers, planers, all that big old very expensive equipment just to start building. So starting out, all you're going to need is a way to cut the wood and a way to put the wood together. That's a basic overall principle of woodworking. Uh, it can be a little more complicated than that when you get into different types of joinery, but you're still cutting the wood and putting it together. So let's don't overcomplicate things and make it seem like this is not an attainable hobby or business to make. Uh, you can do this, it's not that hard. Don't let others make you think that it's some kind of uh, exclusive club that nobody else can get into unless you have $10,000 to start a shop. That's just not true. You don't need $1,000 to start a shop. I dare say for $300 or less, if you borrow your tools or buy them used, you can get started making projects like I started making on this channel. So making those type of projects sold extremely well. I have several videos on my top selling projects. I've sold tons of this stuff uh, locally and online for the smaller items. I don't ship large items. So if you're looking to get started woodworking, you want some basic tools. I recommend a drill and impact driver set, uh, a circular saw, a pocket hole jig, a square and a tape measure. So that's six items that I think you need to build the type of projects on this channel. So these tools will be linked in the description below if you wanna go check them out for yourself. I will also link a less expensive uh, combo set in the description if you don't have $250 to go buy a combo set like this. I'm a big fan of Comelon tape measures. I bought this one, it's gonna be included in the giveaway. Uh, I use one every day. Uh, I just did a video on tape measures, uh, if you go back and look. And then also the Swanson Speed Square. The reason I recommend this one over just a regular square is because you can cut uh, degrees with it. You can mark and measure degrees. So like on the, the J-Bates chairs and benches, they all have 10 degree uh, legs on them at 10 degree angles and several other 10 degree cuts. That's how I started was with a Swanson Speed Square. Very simple build. So for cutting the wood, just a simple, just a simple circular saw. This is the DeWalt six and a quarter or six and a half inch uh, circular saw. This is a really nice saw, like really nice. Uh, it, uh, if you go back and watch the unboxing and review of this video, it just smooths right through that uh, two before, smooth as butter, just right through it. This impact driver has a lot of power. I was able to drive a screw right through oak, uh, no problem at all, right through there. Uh, this is a really nice compact impact driver. This is great for driving screws, things like that. This is what I use. Well, actually I use the rigid uh, for driving screws with, but this one is really nice. Then you got a drill just for drilling pilot holes, uh, different types of uh, drill work. You just, I mean, as a woodworker, you drill a lot of holes and this little drill is all you need. You don't, necessarily, you don't need this specific brand. You can buy rigid, you can buy Ryobi, you can buy Porter cable, cobalt, any of those tools starting out will be perfectly fine. So I have an anonymous donor on the channel now. He's donating funds to be able to purchase tools uh, for me to review. If you haven't seen the unboxing and review of that DeWalt combo set, it's the last video right before this one, go check it out. This is what's awesome about that. I'm giving this tool set away. It's a drill, it's an impact driver, it's a circular saw and a flashlight. Not only that, it's a Craig K5. I call this a beginner woodworker's set because that's what I used to start. I was able to take a circular saw and a drill and start making awesome projects. So what can you build with just a circular saw, a drill, and a square basically is all I had to start with. Let me tell you, I built this J Bates chair and table set. I also built a bench that matched it once I got the Craig R3 pocket hole jig. The R3 was like $30, $40 to get started, so I, I chose that one because it was less expensive. But you'll notice the difference in the chair set that have the screws uh, exposed. You can see those screws right here. And then the bench that's very similar design. It's actually the same footprint, it's just stretched out. I use the pocket holes to put that together and you don't see those screw holes, so it makes it a cleaner look. However, you don't have to have a pocket hole jig. You can do this stuff without it. The other projects I made with just having a circular saw, drill in the square, are this very basic coffee table, a simple entryway or hall table like this one, uh, some very simple benches like this, 
a small console table specifically out of two before that's all this was made out of i even made an end table with just two befores and some one by material for the bottom shelf all with a circular saw and a, a square and a drill that's all you need i even was able to make this farmhouse dining table and a bench to match circular saw drill and a square look at this thing i mean i'm still proud of it to this day and it was my very first one that was a commission sale Somebody asked me if I could make it. I was like, I think I, I think I can. And so I started it and was able to do this with just built only out of two by fours. I think the top was two by eights or two by sixes, two by eights. There was no jointing going on here. It was all screws and, and pocket holes. It come out good, man. I'm telling you, this table looks so good for just being able to use circular saws and drills. You can do this stuff with basic tools. Also noticed that my workspace was in the living room. I want to give a huge shout out to Miss 731 for allowing me to use the living room as my finishing area before I was able to move into this garage that you see here now. So do not be ashamed of humble beginnings. I started out with those borrow tools. Some of you are starting out with those type tools. Uh, you can pick them up used, you can pick them up new. Whatever you're starting with, you don't need a bunch of tools to get started. These are essential, basic woodworking tools. Like I've said before, all you need is a way to cut the wood and a way to put that wood together. A circular saw, a drill, impact, and a pocket hole jig really is all you need. You don't even need the pocket hole jig, but it is nice to have. How are you gonna win the DeWalt combo kit, Swanson Speed Square, the tape measure, and the Craig K5 all in one little awesome bundle? And not just the Craig K5, it comes with a face clamp, and a box of screws to get you started. So you're gonna have everything you need, minus maybe a driver bit and a drill bit to get you started. How do you win it? Man, I really wish that I was able to give every single beginner woodworker who has nothing or has the like really older tools that they're really struggling with, I wish I could give you, every one of you, one of these kits. The fact is that I can't. My hope is if you don't need this stuff, you won't enter the contest. There will be other tools coming that if you need, you can enter. Please refrain from entering if you don't need it. Now, if you wanna enter, in the description below is a link to gleam.io. I'm gonna use that as my giveaway. You click that link, it takes you to that. That's where you're gonna enter the giveaway and then there'll be a random drawing. We're on February 9th on our live show called Live Edge. We have that every Tuesday night at 7 p.m. right here on YouTube. You can join in. You do not have to be present to win, but we will draw the winner live on the show. Uh, good luck. This is not sponsored by YouTube. They have nothing to do with this. This is from the anonymous donor, and then I'm just paying it forward to you guys. Check the link in the description below for the official rules. Uh, this is US only, so I'm very sorry to anybody who is outside the continental US. Somebody gonna get lucky, I'm telling you. This is an awesome prize kit. For a beginner woodworker, this is all the tools you need to win this to get you started. This could change your life. Can tools change your life? They changed mine. Five tools changed my life. I think I'll make a video on that. Five tools changed my life. All right, so if you like this video, go ahead and click that box right there. Clicking that box takes you to the next set of videos. If you click that box, you get that big old virtual fist bump. Also, you can click that box right there. It's another one of my favorites. If you hadn't subscribed yet, click that subscribe button. There's going to be more stuff like this going on on the channel. I'm very excited about it. See you on the next one.